I will send to you from the Father, the Spirit of Truth, who goes out from the Father. He will testify about me. And you also must uh, testify. For you have been with me from the beginning. Praise the Lord. Jesus Christ was saying about the Spirit of God. So today I want to say to all the people, the Spirit of God is, this is a gift which our God has given to you today. So that we have to give, we can give the thanks and praise to the Lord because of the gift of this God. Praise the Lord. Today I want to say, during the time of this Word of God, the Spirit of God will lead you, guide you, and fulfill all your desire before the week. Uh, we are ending this next section. Praise the Lord. So that may our God bless you more and more today during the time of this praise and worship and word of God. Let us raise our hand and come pray to the Lord. Heavenly Father, in the name of Jesus Christ, I pray for each one of them, especially the people are watching online, the people are hearing this word of God. Heavenly Father, bless them, Father. Give them your glory spiritually and physically all the areas of their life, Father. Heavenly Father, all this Bible section and give in your hand. Thank you for your blessing, everybody. I prefer Brother Madan join from USA. Sister Jordan join from USA. I bless you, and dear family, Father. Bless them, Father. Give them the glory spiritually and physically and financially all the years of their life. In Jesus' name. I pray. You want to say amen? Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. So, uh, Brother Mardan is joined from USA. USA. Thank you, Brother, joined from USA. Praise the Lord, Lady the Praise and Worship. Thank you for joining the last uh, Wednesday also. This is a blessing for everybody. Shake the nation. Can I invite you to say hi to the world, brother? And meet your audio. Hello, everyone. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord, everyone. So thank you very much, everybody. Please share this gospel message to the nations. So today, Sheikh the Nation, the UK is inviting Brother Madan to lead the praise and worship under 30 minutes time from now on. This is your time, Brother. God bless you. Hallelujah. We worship you, Father. Let's, let's just um, we thank the Lord Almighty for giving me such a wonderful time of prayer, such a wonderful time of praise and worship. Now, worship is the only thing that you can do anywhere you are. Right? You can be driving, you can be in a car, you can be in your office, you can be in the bed. Because David says that even though he is lying on the bed, his heart still worships God. So praise is the only thing that you and me can do even when we are in the bed or when we are walking or driving or whatever. So that is the greatest tool God has given to all of us. Because the Bible says that God has created the humans just that we can worship Him. The Bible also says the Lord is delighted in the worship. Where two or three gather in my name and worship, when two or three gather in my name, I will be with them, says the Lord. And I, I believe that as we all start worshiping God, I believe God is going to move mightily in the midst of us. I believe God is going to move mightily. You know, whatever situations we may be going through, whatever health conditions we may be going through, I might not know it, but God knows what we are going through right now. And that's all we need these days. Right? So uh, I just want you all to just close your eyes and say, Lord, thank you for all that you have done to me. Thank you for your grace to us, Lord. Thank you for your protection on us. Thank you for your kindness towards us, Lord. Thank you for leaving us in this life, in this earth. Thank you for keeping us in this earth, Lord. Thank you for giving us the health that we want. Thank you for giving us all this, all our needs today, Lord. If you had eaten today, it's all because of His grace. If you have had a good night's sleep, it's all because of God's grace. If you are living under a shelter, it's because of God's grace. And if you have a cloth to wear, it's because of God's grace. Most time, often we forget to think about those little things that we experience every day and we take it for granted. And today I just want you to say, Lord, thank you. Thank you, Lord, for all that you have done to me. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord, for all that you have done to me. Hallelujah. We worship you, Father. We worship you, Lord. We worship you, Lord. We worship you. We thank you. We thank you. We thank you. 
uncertainties, insecurities. There's one hope for us. When the oceans rises and thunders roar, oh, I will worship you, Lord. I will soar upon the waves. The hope that we have on God is when the Israelites were walking all through Egypt, to Canaan. Through the wilderness, they had divine protection. The clouds following them wherever they went. The pillar of fire. Oh, that same pillar of fire is following us wherever we go today. His wings is more than enough to protect us from all these viruses. His wings is more than enough to protect us from all the dangers that we can see. Oh, hallelujah. Hallelujah. Oh, cry me now under.
mighty hand. Sing it one more time. I breathe now. Oh, 
Father, hallelujah. We worship you, Father, hallelujah. Hallelujah. Lord, we thank you for everyone who watches this right now. We thank you for everyone who worships with us right now. We pray that you will be with them for the rest of the day, Lord. We come at the rest of the session in your mighty hands. And as we go ahead and hear what you have to say, Lord, we pray that you will give us the light and the truth that we need to hear. We pray for everyone who's going to join and hear this online. And we pray that your Spirit of God will move with amidst each and every one. Lord, we come at everything in your mighty hands. We pray in Jesus' name. Amen. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Wonderful worship. Powerful worship. Uh, thank you for uh, Brother Madan. Thank you for the powerful worship. We can give powerful clap to Jesus Christ for this worship. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. We can pray for this brother right now. Um, this brother and family and everybody and their family, we can give the praise and thanks to the Lord right now. Heavenly Father, in the name of Jesus Christ, I pray this brother. Madan. I bless his brother, Father, spiritually and physically, all the areas of brother life. Keep brother in your glory, Father, in all the areas of brother life. Heavenly Father, I pray for all the people, those who could watch online this worship. Thank you for your sent, your anointing to each one of them, Father. Heavenly Father, I, once again more, I pray for all the people, those who are joining online. Bless them. Thank you for your blessing and keep keeping them in your glory. In Jesus' name, I pray. Amen. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Thank you, Brother uh, Madan. Now, I'm going to share the word of God. Not much of time. Around 30 minutes time. Praise the Lord. I'm not sharing much, but a little bit. Praise the Lord. The people are watching online. Uh, joining with us. Please, uh, hear this word of God. I know this word of God. When the time of hearing this word of God, you will get more power and anointing because through this word of God. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Just I want to, today, uh, I would like to read today, I would like to speak about the power of the Lord, the presence of the Holy Spirit. The book of Gospel, John chapter 15, the last uh, words and also gospel joint chapter 16 from the beginning part jesus Christ was saying to his disciple the power of the holy spirit this is a holy spirit generation praise the lord the power of the holy spirit somebody want to say the power of the holy spirit the more you say the more power and more miracle you can see the more you say about uh, the Holy Spirit, the more power you can see in your eyes. So that everybody, um, people are watching online, hearing this word of God, ask to the Holy Spirit to get more anointing in your life. Then our Holy Spirit can provide you. Just Gospel John, Chapter 15, the last part, verse 26, the work of the Holy Spirit. Praise the Lord. This is a Holy Spirit generation. Most of the people are saying, I don't know. I don't have much faith. What will I do? I don't have anything in my life. I cannot grow in my prayer. I cannot even pray, pray for two, you know, one hour time, 30 minutes time. I cannot continuously, I cannot go. I cannot be able to go ahead with my prayer. There are lots of things are coming against my life. Only one thing I want to say to all the people, the people are watching online, this is a Holy Spirit generation. So that, okay, after the resurrection of Jesus Christ, all the apostles in the early centuries and all the disciples, um, the, the people are living in this world, um, people they were living in this world, all the disciples, all the ministers, all the pastors, they were doing the miracle by the power of the Holy Spirit in the name of Jesus Christ. Holy Spirit, that means the Spirit of Father. Praise the Lord. The same Spirit raised Jesus Christ from the death to the life. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. That's what goes for John chapter 15, where it is 26 Bible says, when the advocate comes, 
whom I will send to you from the Father, the Spirit of Truth, who goes out from the Father, he will testify about me. And you also must testify, for you have been with me uh, from the uh, beginning. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Again, the Bible says all this. Again, the Bible says, but now I am going to him who sent me. None of you ask me where you are going. Verses, Gospel John chapter 16, verses 5 and 6. Rather, you are filled with the grief because I have said these things. All the teachings when Jesus Christ was uh, with uh, all the disciples, praise the Lord. All the disciples, they were so much, they were not, not at all much happy to live in the presence of Jesus Christ by, in flesh. But Jesus Christ is saying, if I'm not going to my father's place, that means it is not good for you. If I am going to my father's place, that is uh, that is a good thing for you. Because if I am not reaching my father's place, I cannot be able to send the promise from the heavenly father. Because of this reason for your benefit. Praise the Lord. I should go to my father's place. That means I should get a death and resurrection and everything. It should happen. Because of this reason, Jesus Christ was teaching to the disciple about the glory after his death and resurrection, which is going to come to all the, not only to the disciple, but to all of the people. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Bible says, verse 6 says, rather you are filled with the grief because I have said these things. But very truly I tell you, it is for your good that I am going away unless I go away, the advocate will not come to your to you. But if I go, I will send him to you. This is a duty of the Jesus Christ to send the promise of the Heavenly Father to each one of you. Praise the Lord. According to the Bible, the promise of the Heavenly Father, it has already reached to us during the time of our born again. Now what you have to do, we should come to know the presence of the Holy Spirit in our heart. Praise the Lord. This is what we had to do it. Verses 8 Bible said, when he comes, he will prove the world to be in the wrong about sin and righteousness and judgment. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Again, verse 13 Bible says, but when he, in the spirit of truth comes, he will guide you to all the truth. That means we are living in this world. We don't know what to do. We don't know how to do it. Sometimes, most of the times, we are um, um, we are doing lots of mistakes. Who can? Who will come and correct you? Praise the Lord. Sometimes, always you will not leave your father and mom. Those who are living in this world by flesh. Even if we are, you are living with them. They can guide you, but there is some limitation to guide, to get the guidance from them. So that they cannot, 100%, they cannot guide you. They don't know your heart. But the Spirit of God can discern your heart. The Spirit of God can always look and see what is there in your heart. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. So that even if you are not asking to the Spirit of God anything, if you are praying in a tongue, if you are giving the praise and worship, during that time, the Spirit of God Himself will discern, discern. The Spirit of God will automatically will look at your heart. What is there? Um, what exactly you want to get it in your life? Accordingly, when the time of the praise and worship, uh, during the time of making the fellowship with, the, with Jesus Christ, Heavenly Father, you will get it. Praise the Lord. That is wonderful. In the present, Apostle Paul, he was praising God. Our God is. Uh, seeing his heart, what exactly he need. Accordingly, our God is doing the performing the miracle to him. Praise the Lord. So today, this is a Holy Spirit generation. Each and every people, praise the Lord. You yourself come to know the you know the the powerful the power of the Holy Spirit. This is a divine power. This Spirit of God can do the creative miracle in your life. Praise the Lord. Bible says, praise the Lord. But when he 
the spirit of truth comes he will guide you into all truth all the truth he will not speak on his own he will speak only what he hears and he will tell you what is yet to come he will glorify me because it is from me that he will receive what he will make known to you praise the lord all that belongs to the father is mine that's why i said the spirit will receive from me what he will make known to you praise the lord hallelujah so that everybody each and every people praise the lord when the spirit of god is coming to your heart you will get a joyful heart what all the grief what all the sorrows what all the disappointment it is there in your heart this is a duty of the holy spirit to take away from you because the fruit of the holy spirit is joy praise the lord the peaceful mind praise the lord and you got confidence you will get it praise the lord this is what okay um, this is a fruits from the heaven fruits of the holy spirit bible says jesus okay, said i tell you you will weep and mourn while the world rejoices you will grieve but your grief will turn to joy how how it is your grief will turn to joy but through the holy spirit through the spirit of god the spirit of god always will give you praise the lord the motivation in your life the spirit of god always will give you the hope in your life hope in your life the spirit of god always will give you good confidence in your life praise the lord so that all the born again people how we can survive our life in this world because of you are the you are leading by the spirit of god that's what uh, bible says the the book of john bible says praise the lord we are anointed from the holy one we are anointed by the power of the holy spirit because of this reason this anointing itself will come and teach you what you should do it what you should not do it what you are to supposed to do in your in this world this anointing will come and teach you so that anointing none other things in the old testament and the new testament praise the lord in the old testament uh, king david praise the lord and everybody received the anointing this is from the holy spirit the spirit of god praise the lord so that i want to say to all the people when you are getting the anointing from the holy spirit it just already sealed praise the lord so that nobody can take away this anointing from you the more you spend the time with the god the more miracle we can see in your life verse 22 bible says again bible says bible says so so you now you are um now is your time of grief but i will see you again and you will rejoice and no one will take away your joy praise the lord hallelujah that is what bible says praise the lord um um again verse 23 says gospel john chapter 16 verse 23 bible says in that day you will no longer ask me anything very truly i tell you very truly i tell you my father will give you whatever you ask in my name by the power of the holy spirit in my name praise the lord so that what all the things praise the lord hallelujah again bible says until now you have not asked for anything in my name ask and you will receive and your joy will become great in another thing there is a hidden meaning in this okay if you want to ask something to jesus christ to the lord to get in your life you should have the confidence how you will get this confidence this knowledge this faith in christ jesus through the holy spirit this is the so for example all the disciples of jesus christ they were so much afraid after the death of jesus they went for fishing but jesus christ appeared around 40 times after after the death of jesus christ after the resurrection in front of all the disciples jesus christ ate food with them had the breakfast with disciple praise the lord and jesus christ is teaching about the glory of the lord what uh, is going to happen in your life jesus christ has given the commandment to all the disciples book of acts chapter 1 and 2 do not depart from the jerusalem be in jerusalem i will send the promise from the heavenly father when all the disciples received the promise from the heavenly father till before that till that time they were having the 
um they were having the worries and disappointment in their heart praise the lord they are, they were much so much scared to go forward in their life but at to receive the spirit of god in them what they did praise the lord they were preaching the gospel boldly to the nations in all the places in all over the places praise the lord so that i want to say to all the people so um because of this reason boldly apostle paul apostle peter praise the lord and apostle john everybody they were preaching the gospel because of the power of the holy spirit so that i want to say to all the people if you are a born again person praise the lord you are leading and you are uh, uh, walking by the power of the holy spirit in each and every time praise the lord hallelujah nobody can take you away your joy full heart from you praise the lord hallelujah that is what the bible third john chapter 1 verse 2 says a dear friend i pray that you may enjoy good health and that all may go well to with you even as your soul is getting along well praise the lord this is what okay all with this spirit is the bible says okay i pray that you may enjoy good health and that all may go well with the truth praise the lord hallelujah so uh each and every people uh the people are watching online praise the lord hallelujah yeah. when the spirit of god is coming another thing praise the lord apostle john he was witnessing jesus christ to the nations he was saying about all the uh, the work of the lord what i have seen that is what i am preaching today in jesus christ there is no darkness at all praise the lord that means jesus upon all the disciples they were witnessing the truth of the god praise the lord when the who are heard this word of god they could also receive the salvation in their heart because of this reason by the power of the holy spirit book of acts chapter 2 3000 people praise the lord could able to receive the salvation in their heart praise the lord third john chapter 1 verses 4 bible says i have no greater joy than to hear that my children are walking in the truth what is the truth the truth is praise the lord hallelujah in jesus christ there is no darkness at all jesus christ is the light of the world what is the truth in jesus christ there is a forgiveness of your sins by the blood of jesus christ praise the lord the blood of jesus christ cleanses our all the sins praise the lord hallelujah this is the truth through jesus christ in the name of jesus christ we are getting salvation we are the new creation those who are in christ jesus there is no condemnation for them this is the truth praise the lord one day we were far away from the glory of the lord we were under the law of moses we were in another words we were living under the uh, darkness of the world praise the lord under the satan under the bondage of satan but today by knowing jesus christ is your lord and savior praise the lord, you are we are no more under the law of moses we are no more under the bondage of satan we are free from the bondage of satan now we are under the grace of god we are also in the family members of the lord praise the lord hallelujah this is the truth this is what bible says praise the lord hallelujah so the if you are in christ jesus we cannot do any of the evil things in our life we cannot harm anybody's heart we cannot do anything against anybody praise the lord we cannot do anything against anybody bible says third john chapter 1 verse 11 says bible says dear friend do not imitate what is evil but what is good anyone who does what is good is from god praise the lord anyone anyone who does what is evil has not seen god praise the lord so that if you are in christ jesus if you when you preach the gospel this is a good things which you are doing when you are witnessing our god this is a good things how we are doing this is from god if you are not preaching gospel praise the lord if you are saying something why walking by the wicked ways praise the lord the world things and lust and fornications praise the lord and all these things 
if you are doing this is not from God. This is from the evil one. So that we are the light of the world. We cannot do all these things. If you are the children of God, even if you are walking, if you are doing the sinful life, Bible says the nature of the Lord when it is coming to you, automatically, you know, you can, um, the that all the evil spirit work, it will go away from you. You will get a new heart, praise the Lord, new mind, new thoughts. New, you, you will get new vision. Everything will be new in your life. Right. That is what the Bible says. Those who are in Christ Jesus, you are the new creation. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. The truth of the Lord is First John chapter 1, verses 5. Bible says, This is a message we have heard from Him and declared to you. God is light. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Let me put the battery. <coughs> yeah. And I'm preaching it outside so that I had put the battery on. God is light. There is a Lord. Hallelujah. As he is in the light, we have fellowship with one another. And the blood of Jesus Christ, his son, purifies us from all sins. There is a Lord. Hallelujah. So that whenever, another thing, when you are walking by the presence of the Lord, what is going to happen in your life? There is a Lord. Again, I want to say, our God himself will come and get his protection. Like the King David, he was saying, always I'm seeing the right side of, you know, um, I'm always uh, um, seeing um, my gods in my eyes. Praise the Lord. Because Psalm chapter 18, verse 6, Bible says, in my distress, I called to the Lord. I cried to my God for help. From his temple, he heard my voice. My cry came before him into his ears. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Book of Psalm chapter 18, verse 16. Bible says, praise the Lord. He reached down from on high and took hold of me. He drew me out of deep waters. Praise the Lord. Again, Bible says, how he could able to defeat all his enemies. Praise the Lord. They were having a greater power than me. By, but the presence of the Lord is with me because of this reason I could be able to defeat all my adversaries. Praise the Lord. Because Psalm chapter 18, verse 17, Bible says, He rescued me from my powerful enemy, from my foes, who were too strong for me. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Again, the Bible says, They comforted me in the day of my distress, disaster. But the Lord was my support today i want to say the lord will be your support in all the days of your life the lord will take care of your life in all the days of your life the lord will never leave you nor forsake you the lord will honor you the lord will multiply you the lord will make you the great to the nations the lord can get you a reason to enjoy your life praise the lord through the lord praise the lord each and every day you will get a um, reason to share your testimony in front of everybody. Book of, that's what the book of Philippians chapter 4 verse 6 says, if the spirit of God is leading you ever in your life, Bible says praise the Lord, do not be anxious about anything, but in every situation, by prayer and petition, with a thanksgiving, present your request to the Lord. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. That means our God is always watching you. The most of the people are living in this world each and every day. We are making lots of complaints in front of the Lord. We are saying, oh God, what will I do? But I want to say, if you are leading by the Spirit of God today, praise the Lord. Bible says, do not anxious. Bible says, do not be anxious about anything. Nothing to worry anything about uh, your life. But in every situation, by prayer and petition with the thanksgiving, present your request to the Lord. Praise the Lord. Hand over your request to the Lord. In all the time, in all the days, you have to hand over your request to the Lord, your prayer request. That means with the thanksgiving. If you want to give the thanksgiving, what you, you should have the hope. You should have the confidence in God. How you will get the confidence? By the presence of the Holy Spirit. This is what I have. I want to encourage to all the people today. Praise the Lord. Sometimes in your life, you cannot do anything. For example, when I was preaching the gospel in the street, 
sometimes I cannot do anything. Nobody is helping me. Nobody is standing surrounding me. Of me. What will I do it? That time I myself will get encouraged. I will ask the Holy Spirit, come and help me. Give me the revelation. Give me the power. I myself go ahead. I cannot go ahead. I need a presence. The same time, the Spirit of God was coming and helping me and teaching me. Sometimes my faith, it was falling down. That time I was saying, praying to the Holy Spirit, come and help me. I cannot do anything in my life. Praise the Lord. Spirit of God is helping me. Some, sometimes people, when they were coming um, for the prayer, I was asking to the Holy Spirit, Holy Spirit, help me. Show me the healing in my eyes. You know, most of the time, lots of healing I could be able to hear, see in my eyes. Praise the Lord. In your weakness, Bible, that is Bible says, in your weakness, the God's power will come today. Praise the Lord. In your disappointment, our God's confidence in your will come in your heart. Our God's, the nature it will come in your heart. The peace of mind you will get it. The lots of people are, during the time of 2020 and 2021, it was a pandemic situation. You are worrying about your life. You are thinking tomorrow, what will happen? How will go ahead today? Lots of people, they are saying lots of things about, uh, you know, that lots of things. But only one thing I want to say, our God is a miracle Lord. He will never leave you nor forsake you. He is a God Almighty. Because, because of this reason, even if lots of prosecution and supply, you know, uh, prosecution happened in the early centuries of our church, church got scattered. The people, those who, those who got scattered, praise the Lord, the ministers, they were preaching the gospel to all the places. How it happened? Because the Spirit of God was pushing them. Praise the Lord. Today, you know, all the people, the year of 2021, 2022, praise the Lord, 2021, you could not do anything. But in the year of 2022, the more you are having the desire to the Lord, the more our God will help you, the more our God will honor you, the more our God uh, will uh, raise you. Praise the Lord. Only one thing I want to say to all the people, come out. Uh, in the presence of, please be in the presence of the Lord. Then this God will honor you. This God will multiply you. This God will make you perfect in your nations. Praise the Lord. So that I, this is what the Bible says. Praise the Lord. Be anxious. Not nothing. Do not be anxious about anything. Bible says, but in every situation, by prayer and petition, with the thanksgiving, present your request to the Lord. And the peace of God, which it will be there in your heart in all the times. Praise the Lord. So that Apostle Paul, this book, he was writing this book when he was in the present. Praise the Lord. Um, so that only one thing what he had to do it, book of Psalm chapter 27, verses 14. Even him, Apostle Paul, he was in the present. He was having the hope in God. Praise the Lord. Strong heart he was having. Confidence in his having, in his heart, it, it, he was having. He was not at all worried about the death uh, in his flesh. He was always saying, thinking about the glorious life after the death, which our God want, uh, which our God is giving for him. Praise the Lord. The eternal crowd. He was always thinking about. He was always um, having the confidence about the eternal crowd which our God has kept to be kept for him before the foundation of the world. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. So that he, all the people, those are living in this world, praise the Lord, don't put hope in your perish perishable things, world things, your money and all these things. Praise the Lord. Most of the people are worrying about your money. Praise the Lord. Always put the first preference to the word of God. Praise the Lord. Whenever you are giving you are putting your first preference to the word of God. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. This, go, this word of God will make you um, a great in the nation. This word of God will make your name will become great. This word of God will never leave you nor forsake you. This word of God will never put your face ashamed. In all the places, you will get a reason to rejoice in your life. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. So that Bible book of Psalm chapter 27, verses 14, Bible says, wait for the Lord, be strong and take heart and wait for the Lord. Praise the Lord. So that uh, this is what the people are born again, people. You should always wait for the Lord. Don't put any of the time in front of the Lord. Praise the Lord. Our God is working on you, in your problems, in your situations, in your hope, 
in your prophecy, which you have received 2020 and 2021, 2022, and everything. Our God still is working on in that. Praise the Lord. So that always put your hope in God and go forward. Praise the Lord. Bible says the heaven and earth will get passed away. The word which our God has said from his mouth, this cannot be changed. Praise the Lord. This will remain same. That means what all the things it has written in this Bible, that is for you and me. So that everybody, I want to say that one, praise the Lord. Never get disappointment today onwards. We have to be strong in Christ Jesus. We have to say to the people, to the world in the year of 2022, I will see the goodness of the Lord. The goodness and mercy will follow me. Praise the Lord. In all the days of your life, my God will protect me. The people are thinking, I cannot go forward. The people are thinking, I, I will not get job. The people are thinking, I don't have house. But our God is a richest God. He can be able to provide all these things, whatever I need in my life. This is what today, all the people you want to say from your mouth, my God is a living God. My God is a powerful Lord. My God is a mighty Lord. Because of this reason, wherever I'm touching my feet, wherever I am walking, I cannot see any other failure. I am the victorious person. I am the winner. I cannot be, I'm not a failure person. I am the winner. Maybe the world of people are looking at the situation which I'm facing today. But the world will never look at the world of people. The satanic world was looking at Jesus Christ and they were rejoicing during the time of the death of Jesus Christ. They told it is finished. Jesus Christ will never come out from the tomb. But entire heaven, what entire heaven was looking at Jesus Christ. But in all the satanic world, when they were thinking, that it is finished after the death of Jesus Christ. But entire heaven, the heavenly father, he was having a great plan through Jesus Christ before the foundation of the world. Praise the Lord. All the mankind, all the 800 class people are living in this world. You should get salvation. You will get the salvation. You are going to get the salvation by the death and resurrection of Jesus Christ. Without the death, there is no salvation. Without the death, there is no salvation. Praise the Lord. So today, I want to see the world, the satanic world will look at your face. They will know what happened in your life. What happened in this situation. So how long you are praying to the Lord? How long you are serving the Lord? Our God is saying, wait for that one. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Our God is saying, wait and see the work of the Lord. Praise the Lord. So that if our God is for you, who can stand against you? No. Our God is God of victory. Our God is a God of miracle Lord. Our God is a God of powerful Lord. Because of this reason, the people are serving our Lord. Our God will never put your face ashamed. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. So that the people are watching online. Only one thing I want to say to all the people, the work which you're doing for God, never give up. Okay. So that, you know, that your last um, two years, nearly two years are going to get over continuously by the grace of God. Pastor Joel is doing, Shaitan National UK was doing this revival meeting. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. In between, we could able to connect the TV. TV channel, it was so expensive, so I cannot do it right now. But my God is faithful God. Again, our God will give on TV channel for shake the nations in future we will daily will broadcast our um, you know the gospel revival with the tv we believe god we believe miracle praise the lord hallelujah so that i want to say to all the people our god is a god of miracle praise the lord hallelujah so that why we are living in this world to receive the glory of the lord bible says second Thessalonians chapter 2 verses 14 bible says he called you to, to this through our gospel that you might share in the glory of our Lord Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ is so much excited, so much happy to share all the gift, hand over all his gift to you, dear friends. You are gifted. So what do you have to do? It The more you are doing for doing the work of the Lord today, the more thing our God can do through your hand. When I'm preaching the gospel um, in the streets, praise the Lord. I know that wherever I'm preaching the gospel, nowadays, you know that one, Lots of people are from this country, English people. This week I'm going to, tomorrow on which I'm starting my mission trip. Praise the Lord. English people, I know that one, uh, yeah, this from, people are from this country. They invited me to preach in their place. And probably Yorkshire and surrounding areas. Praise the Lord. So that you know that one, how all these people are doing, calling, because we are doing the work of the Lord. Praise the Lord. So um, when you are doing the little, little things for God, our God will raise you. Praise the Lord. And it, so that everybody, the work which you are doing for God, continuously go ahead. Our God will raise you. Never look at your age. 
never look at your situation. Our God can get you a long life. I will get a long life in Christ Jesus. Praise the Lord, because I have got a lot of prophecy in my life. That prophecy want to get fulfilled in my life. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. So that come me, never look at the never. Please don't compare the people according to age. Praise the Lord. How many number of people there? No more in this world. 18 years, 15 years, 20 years, 25 years. Praise the Lord. 10 years, 5 years. How many hundred thousand people got died? Praise the Lord. Every day is getting died. Because, you know, that one, uh, uh, in between, we are protected. We are uh, secured in our place. The reason is our God is having a greatest plan towards you. The greatest ministry of our God is handed over to you. Through you, you will see your children's children, generations, generation. This is what our God's prophecy. Amen. So that everybody, the work which you're doing for God, please carry on with your work, good work. Okay. Continuously, please go ahead with your good work. This God will never leave you. No, forsake you. This God will every day, this God will get you a reason to rejoice in your life. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. That's what the Bible says. Second, second Thessalonians chapter 3, verse 3, Bible says, but the Lord is faithful and he will strengthen you and protect you from the evil one. Right? This is what our God is a um, you know, faithful God in all the areas of your life. What all the situation which you are facing, our God is saying he will give the strength and power to you. Praise the Lord. Our God is saying book of Isaiah chapter 10 to 41 day, verse 10 to 13, I can give my righteous right hand towards you. Praise the Lord. Fear no time with you. This is what our God is saying. How many number of times our God has written in this Bible, fear no time with you. Our God was saying to the Joshua, fear not. As I was with the Moses, I will be with you all the days of your life. Book of Gospel, John chapter 14, verses 1 Bible says, fear not, praise the Lord. So that in all the places, in all the time, Bible says, praise the fear not. Always our God is saying, fear not. Today, Bible, I want to say, according to the gospel, never look at your situation. Fear not. Go, walk forward. Praise the Lord. Cast your net the right side of the boat. Praise the Lord. With confidence. Then you will get a multitude of fish. Praise the Lord. What all your desires, what all the things which are aesthetic in your life, put on step forward and walk. In the year of 2022, will be a victorious day in your life. In the year of 2022, our God wants to grant or fulfill all your desire before the end of the December of 2022. Praise the Lord. All the people are watching today. I know that when you will receive the glory of the Lord in all the days of your life. Oh, what all the days you are crying in front of the Lord, your all the tears, it is already received in the hands of the Lord. Your prayer answer it at the earliest is going to come in your life. Praise the Lord. So that all the people are watching online, never give up your confidence in God. Praise the Lord. Never give up the work of the Lord. You have to continuously go ahead with the work of the Lord. One day, this God will make you great into the nation. Praise the Lord. I was thinking when I was doing the gospel work in the state, some people, they were mocking. I was not at all minding all these people. They, I, I, because um, all these perishable people, I don't want to mind this perishable thing. People, praise the Lord, hallelujah, because of this reason. And I know that one. Some people are some places are mocking. I will never mind it. And because I'm doing, I'm so much happy to do my duty, the God's, the, the whichever God has given to me, the gospel work, praise the Lord. So that whenever you are doing the gospel work, our God will give the protection. Our God will connect you with more people. Our God will guide you in all the days of your life. Praise the Lord, hallelujah. So that I want to say, um, only when the book of Jeremiah chapter 33, verse 3, all this we have to ask to the Lord to get something in your life. Bible says, call to me and I will give answer in your each and every day. You should have, uh, you know, that one, the planning, what you have to do this week or today or tomorrow or the after tomorrow. And uh, during the time of your prayer, ask to the Lord, oh Lord, this is my desire, help me. Our God will help you. Bible says, call to me and I will give answer you. And, um, Tell you great, uh, call to me and I will answer you and tell you great and unsearchable things you do not know. You do not know. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. So that only one thing, the desire of the Lord, each and every time we have to ask to the Lord. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. So this is what today, before I end this session, I want to ask to each one of you, praise the Lord. Hallelujah. We can ask everything to the Lord uh, in every day, what all the things which you are doing in your day-to-day -day life, everything we can ask to the Lord. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Then our God can show you his glory. This is what 
whenever we are asking each and when we are making more relationship with the god praise the lord i want to say to all the people i have quoted the bible praise the lord apostle paul apostle john and peter they were so much happy um, all spending time with the god jesus christ because of this, this reason jesus christ was showing his power in front of apostle peter and john and james during the time of time progression praise the lord in the mountain so that our god himself he was revealing his power and glory to them so that i want to say to all the people the people are watching online praise the lord never give up the work the vision which our god has given to you this god will make you a great in nation you cannot be a failure in, in christ jesus in all the days of your life you will be a well known person in christ jesus let us pray one minute praise the lord let us raise our hand one minute we can pray praise the lord heavenly father in the name of jesus christ i pray for each one of them especially the people are watching you online the people are here in this spread of god heavenly father pray for the right now father you give one more day for us heavenly father we don't know most of the times what we should do what we should not do heavenly father you yourself you are giving the guidance to us heavenly father you are giving the wisdom and knowledge and power even the midst of the prosecution our rejections and negotiations you are protecting you are raising up our name in front of everybody heavenly father i want to say i believe once again more we are declaring from our heart you are the living god you are the god almighty you are the god of miracles heavenly father i pray for all the people by your stripes you are healed any of the people are suffering any kind of sickness any kind of infirmities heavenly father i pray for all the people in jesus name i declare the healing right now be healed right now receive the healing right now shinda takaladi shada lakna dura tatapa takaladu shinda tapata kalatu rakana shata takaladu rakana in jesus name i pray heavenly father i pray for all the people right now the people are having any kind of sickness father in their body in jesus name i declare to receive them healing right now in jesus name in jesus name i pray pray lots of people are receiving the power of the lord right now move with the power of the lord right now receive it in jesus name right now receive it let the blindness go right now the arthritis receive the healing right now in jesus name the pain of your ear right here move right now go away right now in jesus name headache heavy headache go right now in jesus name this side this side headache go right now in jesus name in jesus name in jesus name shanda lakana shatata batakana ratata shadargana dhuratha pata tachi chatakana kai cast out the spirit of that i call right up in jesus name shanda tapata kaladira in jesus name i pray once again more i pray for all the people the people are watching your name spiritually and physically financially i bless each one of them father give them your glory in jesus name i pray i pray for shake the nation ministry and all the minister those are joined here father heavenly father i pray for our dc to connect our tv and gospel revival with the tv praise the lord heavenly father i pray for all each one of them father give them your glory i pray for all the shake the nation team members i pray for me too all the ministry work which you are doing this this month this week i am preaching the gospel yorkshire tomorrow on bits uh leads northampton and yorkshire and york and the surrounding cities and preaching and i'm preaching uh, swansea heavenly father all the places i give in your hand thank you for your taking care of all these places thank you for your doing the miracle revival from all the cities heavenly father i pray for me and everything all the work thank you for your giving the protection the people are uh, praying by um uh, supported by prayer the people are supported by see that bless father give them the glory once again more i pray for all the people i pray for brother madan join here such a gency jordan gency join from usa i bless the father give them the glory in jesus name i pray amen praise the lord hallelujah we can give wonderful god to you So, so, so jordan gency join from usa if you are there shake the nation want to invite you to sing two or three songs praise the lord hallelujah god bless you sister if you are free you can admit your audio and video you are invited thank you thank you thank you pastor hallelujah 
நன்றி தகப்பனே அப்பா உமக்கு கூடான கூடி ஸ்தோத்திரம் பண்ணுகிறோம் ராஜா உமக்கு நன்றி பலிகளை ஏறெடுக்கிறோம் தகப்பனே இந்த நாளுக்காய் உமக்கு நன்றி செலுத்துகிறோம் ஆண்டவரே தேங்க்யூ அப்பா தேங்க்யூ ராஜா ஹாலில் ஊயா உமக்கு கூடான கூடி நன்றி செலுத்துகிறோம் தகப்பனே நன்றி ஆண்டவரே நன்றி 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 பிதாவே உமக்கு ஸ்தோத்திரம் சுதனே உமக்கு ஸ்தோத்திரம் ஆரோக்கிய நாதரே உமக்கு ஸ்தோத்திரம் எங்களை கரம் பிடித்து வழி நடத்துகிறவரே ஸ்தோத்திரம் ஒன்றுக்கும் ஆண்டவரே ஆண்டவரே உதவாத எங்களையும் எடுத்து நீர் பயன்படுத்தி கொண்டிருக்கிறீரே அப்பா உமக்கு ஸ்தோத்திரம் பண்ணுகிறோம் தகப்பனே ஹாலை லூயா இந்த வேளையில உங்களது சமூகத்துல நாங்கள் ஜபிக்க துதிக்க ஆராதிக்க வந்திருக்கிறோம் உமது நாமத்தை மகிமைப்படுத்திருக்க வந்திருக்கிறோம் உமது ஆவியானவர் எங்களை ஆளுகை செய்து ஆண்டவர் வழி நடத்தும்படியாய் ஆண்டவரை ஜபிக்கிறோம் தகப்பனே ஹோ ரபு ரதி சிகரர ரப ரப ரபது ரபு ஆவியானவரே உமக்கு நன்றி பலிகளை ஏறெடுக்கிறோம் ஆண்டவரே அப்பா உமக்கு நன்றி அப்பா தேங்க்யூ டாடி தேங்க்யூ ஆண்டவரே அப்பாஸ்தோத்ரம் ஆராய்ந்து அறிந்திருக்கின்றி சுற்றி சுற்றி சூழ்ந்திருக்கின்றி ஆராய்ந்து அறிந்திருக்கின்றி சுற்றி சுற்றி சூழ்ந்திருக்கின்றி நான் அமர்வதும் நான் எழுவதும் நான் அமர்வதும் நான் எழுவதும் நன்றாய் நீர் அறிந்திருக்கின்றி மிக நன்றாய் நீர் அறிந்திருக்கின்றி என்னை காண்பவரே தினம் காப்பவரே என்னை காண்பவரே தினம் காப்பவரே எண்ணங்கள் ஏக்கங்கள் எல்லாம் எல்லாமே அருந்திருக்கின்றி என் எண்ணங்கள் ஏக்கங்கள் எல்லாம் எல்லாமே அருந்திருக்கின்றி நடந்தாலும் படுத்தாலும் அப்பா நீர் அறிந்திருக்கின்றி நடந்தாலும் படுத்தாலும் அப்பா நீர் அறிந்திருக்கின்றி நன்றி ராஜா ஏசு ராஜா நன்றி ராஜா ஏசு ராஜா என்னை காண்பவரே தினம் காப்பவரே முன்னும் பின்னும் நெருக்கி நெருக்கி சுற்றி என்னை சூழ்ந்திருக்கின்றி முன்னும் பின்னும் நெருக்கி நெருக்கி சுற்றி என்னை சூழ்ந்திருக்கின்றி உன் திருக்கத்தால் தினமும் என்னை பற்றி பற்றி பிடித்திருக்கின்றி நன்றி ராஜாயிசு ராஜா நன்றி ராஜாயிசு ராஜா என்னை காண்பவரே தினம் காப்பவரே என்னை காண்பவரே தினம் காப்பவரே கருவையும் கண்கள் கண்டன மறைவாய் வாழ்வதை கவனித்தீரே கருவையும் கண்கள் கண்டன 
மறைவாய் வழுவது கவனித்திரு ஆதி சந்தமாய் பிரமிக்கத்தக்க பக்குவமாய் உருவாக்கி ஆதி சந்தமாய் பிரமிக்கத்தக்க பக்குவமாய் உருவாக்கி நந்தி ராஜா இயேசு ராஜா நந்தி ராஜா இயேசு ராஜா என்னை காண்பவரே தினம் காப்பவரே என்னை காண்பவரே தினம் காப்பவரே ஆராய்ந்து அறிந்திருக்கின்றி சுற்றி சுற்றி சூழ்ந்திருக்கின்றி ஆராய்ந்து அறிந்திருக்கின்றி சுற்றி சுற்றி சூழ்ந்திருக்கின்றி நான் அமர்வதும் நான் எழுவதும் நான் அமர்வதும் நான் எழுவதும் நன்றாய் நீர் அறிந்திருக்கின்றி மிக நன்றாய் நீர் அறிந்திருக்கின்றி என்னை காண்பவரே என்னை காப்பவரே என்னை காண்பவரே என்னை காப்பவரே அப்பா நாங்க உமக்கு நன்றி செலுத்துகிறோம் எங்களை காண்கிற தேவனை நோக்கி பார்க்க வந்திருக்கிறோம் எங்களுடைய இருதயத்தில் உள்ள ஆண்டவரே ஆண்டவரை எல்லாவற்றையும் பார்க்கிற தேவன் ஆண்டவரை மனிதர்களுக்கு அது தெரியாதப்பா எங்க இருதயத்துல என்ன இருக்குதுன்னா ஆனா உமக்கு எல்லாம் தெரியும் ஆண்டவரை உமக்கு மறைவானது ஒன்றுமே இல்லை தகப்பனி ஹாலை லூயா அப்பா உமக்கு நன்றி பலிகளை ஏறெடுக்கிறோம் பிதாவே ஆராதிக்கின்றோ ஆர்ப்பிக்கின்றோம் எங்கள் அன்பு செய்கின்றோம் எங்கள் ஆவியானவரே அன்பு செய்கின்றோம் மகளாக திரிந்து கொண்டி மறுபடி பிறக்க செய்தி மகளாக தெரிந்து கொண்டி மறுபடி பிறக்க செய்தி ராஜாக்களும் நாங்கள் ஆசாரியர்களும் நாங்களே ராஜாக்களும் நாங்களே ஆசாரியர்களும் நாங்களே ஆராதிக்கின்றோம் ஆர்ப்பரிக்கின்றோம் அன்பு செய்கின்றோம் உம்மை ஆராதிக்கின்றோ ஆர்ப்பரிக்கின்றோ அன்பு செய்கின்றோ பிதாவே ஆராதிக்கின்றோ ஆர்ப்பரிக்கின்றோ எங்கள் காவியானவரே அன்பு செய்கின்றோ எங்கள் ஆவியானவரே அன்பு செய்கின்றோ 
வைரஸ்ண்டு <laughs> மறைவாயிருப்பதில்லை <laughs> இந்த வேளையிலும் ஒவ்வொருவரோடு நீங்க இடைப்படும்படியாய் நாங்கள் செபிக்கிறோம் அந்த பிறகு யாரெல்லாம் இந்த கொரோனால பாதிக்கப்பட்டிருக்கிறாங்களோ இந்த ஹோமைக்ரானால பாதிக்கப்பட்டிருக்கிறாங்களோ அந்த பிறகு கேன்சர்னால உயிர் கொல்லி நோய்களினால டெத் பெட்ல இருக்கிறவங்க ஐசியூல இருக்கிறவங்க டாக்டர்ஸ் கிடைக்காம போராடிட்டு இருக்கிறவங்க அந்த பிறகு இன்னும் அதிகம் அதிகமான செயல்களினால் அந்த பிறகு என்ன செய்வது என்று தெரியாது விழித்து கொண்டிருக்கிற ஒவ்வொரு ஜனங்களையும் கரத்துக்குள்ளாக நாங்கள் ஒப்புக்கொடுகிறோம் எங்களுடைய தேவாதி தேவன் ஆவியை பொழிந்து ஒவ்வொரு இடத்திலும் ஆண்டு பவர் அத்தாரிட்டி அப்ப ஒவ்வொரு இடத்திலும் ஊற்றப்படுவதாக தகப்பனால் இந்த தேசங்களை நிரப்பும் ஒரு எழுப்புத இந்த தேசங்களிலே உருவாகட்டும் உமது வல்லமை இந்த தேசங்களிலே தங்கட்டும் உமது மகிமை இந்த தேசத்திலே ஆண்டு ஊற்றப்படட்டும் நீங்க ஆண்டு இந்த தேசங்களிலே இருந்து ஆளுகை செய்வதை ஒவ்வொருவரும் கண்டு அவர்கள் முழங்கி கருத்தரை தெய்வம் என்று ஒரு பெருத்த காரியத்தை நீ செய்யும்படியாய் நாங்கள் செபிக்கிறோம் தகப்பனே ஹாலே லூயா அப்பா உமக்கு ஸ்தோத்திரம் பண்ணுகிறோம் தகப்பனே ஆவியானவரே நீங்க பொருட்படுத்திக் கொள்ளுங்கப்பா ஹலே லூயா அப்பா இந்த வேலையில கர்த்தாவே அண்டு பிறகு நீங்க பலப்படுத்தும்படியாய் நாங்கள் ஒப்பு கொடுத்து செபிக்கிறோம் தகப்பனே அண்டு பிறகு ஒவ்வொரு பிள்ளையும் பலப்படுத்துங்க யாரெல்லாம் ஃபியர்னால ஆன்சைட்டினால அப்ப போராடி கொண்டிருக்கிறாங்களோ இந்த சீசன்ல நான் எப்படி இதை நான் கழித்துட்டு போவேன் எனக்கு வேலை இல்லையே வீடு இல்லையே அடிப்படை வசதிகள் சந்திக்கப்படலையே என் பிள்ளைங்க பட்டினியா இருக்குது பசியா இருக்கிறார்களே இந்த கதறி கொண்டிருக்கிற ஒவ்வொரு குடும்பத்தின் தேவைகளை சந்திக்கும்படியாய் நாங்கள் செபிக்கிறோம் பா நீதிமான் அப்பத்துக்கும் தண்ணீருக்கும் அலைந்து தெரிவதில்லை என்று சொல்ல வசனத்தின்படி ஒவ்வொருவரையும் நீங்க போஷிங்க பா உமை அறியாத ஜனங்கள் எல்லாம் உமை அறிந்து கொள்ளவும் உம்மிடத்துல இருந்து மன்னாவை பெற்றுக் கொள்ளவும் நீங்க கிருப பாராட்டுங்க பா உமை அறியாத ஜனங்களுக்காக ரசிக்கப்படாத ஜனங்களுக்காக செபிக்கிறோம் உமது ஆளுகை ஒவ்வொரு மேலும் இருப்பதாக ஒரு பெரிய மாற்றத்தை உண்டு பண்ணும்படியாய் நாங்கள் செபிக்கிறோம் ஆவியானவரே நீர் அன்றுவரை பலப்படுத்தி அன்றுவரை வழி நடத்தும்படி நாங்கள் செபிக்கிறோம் தகப்ப நீ ஹாலே லூயா அண்டவரே இந்த வேளையிலும் ஒவ்வொரு வாலிப பிள்ளைகளை ஒப்பு கொடுக்கிறோம் அந்த பிறகு ஒவ்வொரு யூத் பிள்ளைங்களை ஒப்பு கொடுக்கிறோம் இந்த நாட்களில வீடுகளுக்குள்ளே அடைந்திருக்கிறவர்களை ஒப்பு கொடுக்கிறோம் எல்லாரையும் நீங்க பொருட்படுத்திக் கொள்ளுங்கப்பா அந்த பிறகு இந்த வீடியோ கேம் அடிக்ஷனோ இல்ல மொபைல் அடிக்ஷனோ டிவி அடிக்ஷனோ அந்த பிறகு வேற எந்த டிவைசஸ் அந்த பிறகு எந்த கேஜெட்ஸ் அடிக்ஷனோ இராதபடிக்கு ஒவ்வொருவரையும் பாதுகாத்துக் கொள்ளுங்க இந்த காலத்துல அந்த பிறகு மக்களுக்கே தெரியாமல் ஒரு அடிமைத்தனம் விதைக்கப்படுகிறதை நாங்கள் காண்கிறோம் ஒரு ஃபியர் விதைக்கப்படுவதை நாங்கள் காண் விடுதலை <laughs> கேட்டுக்கொண்டிருக்கிறோம் <laughs> இந்த வேலையிலும் அண்டு பிறகு எல்லா பொலிட்டிக்கல் லீடர்ஸ் அண்டு பிறகு அபிஷியல்ஸ் அப்பா எல்லாரையும் நாங்க ஒப்பு கொடுக்கிறோம் நீங்க ஒவ்வொருவரையும் நீங்க பொருட்படுத்திக் கொள்ளுங்கப்பா எல்லா டாக்டர்ஸ் நர்சஸ் ஃப்ரண்ட் லைன் ஒர்க்கர்ஸ் எல்லாரையும் நாங்க ஒப்பு கொடுக்கிறோம் டீச்சர்ஸ் அப்பா ஸ்கூல்ல எஜுகேஷனல் சிஸ்டம் அண்டு பிறகு ஒவ்வொன்றையும் நாங்க ஒப்பு கொடுக்கிறோம் ஒவ்வொன்று மீதும் உமது கரம் இருப்பதாக தகப்பனே கார்பரேட் கம்பெனிஸ் ஒப்பு கொடுக்கிறோம் அண்டு பிறகு லார்ஜ் ஸ்கேல் ஸ்மால் ஸ்கேல் பிசினஸ் ஒப்பு கொடுக்கிறோம் எல்லா இடங்களிலும் அப்பா எல்லாரும் உண்மை உத்தமாய் ஓட நீங்க கிருப்ப பாராட்டுங்க 
ஒருவரை ஒருவர் ஏமாத்தி வாழாதபடிக்கு அப்ப உமது கரம் அவர்களோடு கூட இருந்து வழி நடத்துவதாக ராஜா அண்டவரே இந்த நேரத்திலே கர்த்தாவே அண்டவரே அநாதைகளுக்காக செபிக்கிறோம் திக்கற்றவர்களுக்காக விதவிகளுக்காக கைவிடப்பட்டவர்களுக்காக அப்பா நாங்கள் செபிக்கிறோம் தகப்பனை அவங்களுடைய தேவைகள் சந்திக்கப்படட்டும் அண்டவரே இந்த நேரத்துல யாரெல்லாம் உண்மை நோக்கி கதறுகிறார்களோ அவர்களெல்லாம் நீங்க அண்டவரை நிரப்பும்படியாய் செபிக்கிறோம் தகப்பனே இன்னும் இந்த தேசத்துல பாலாய் கிடக்கிற ஒவ்வொரு இடங்களை ஒப்பு கொடுக்கிற அக்கிரமங்கள் அநியாயங்கள் பாவங்கள் உமக்கு விரோதமான செயல்கள் எல்லாவற்றையும் நீர் நிர்மூலமாக்கி பிள்ளைகளை அன்றுவரே உமக்குள்ளாய் கட்டி எழுப்பும்படியாய் நாங்கள் செபிக்கிறோம் தகப்பனே நீர் அதை ஆழ்கை செய்து வழி நடத்துங்கப்பா இன்னும் இந்த தேசத்தின் மீது உமது ஆவியானவர் ஊற்றப்படட்டும் ஒரு ரிவைவல் ஸ்பிரிட் ஊற்றப்படட்டும் எழுப்புதல் ஒவ்வொரு தேசங்களில் உண்டாகட்டும் ஆட்களை எழுப்புங்க ஊழியக்காரர்களை எழுப்புங்க அன்றுவரை பிள்ளைகளை எழுப்புங்க உமக்காய் ஓடுகிற ஓட்டத்தினால் அப்பா பிள்ளைகள் அன்றுவரை ஓடத்தக்கதான கிருமையாய் அன்றுவரை நிரப்பும்படியாய் நாங்கள் செபிக்கிறோம் தகப்பனே ஹாலே லூயா அன்றுவரை இங்க இருக்கக்கூடிய ஃபேமிலிஸ்க்காக செபிக்கிறோம் இந்த ஃபேமிலி புரோக்கன் ஆகாம அன்றுவரை டிவோர்ஸ்க்காகவோ அபார்ஷனுக்காகவோ அன்றுவரை ஓடிக்கொண்டு படிக்கு நீங்க பாதுகாத்துக் கொள்ளுங்க செப்பரேட்டட் ஃபேமிலிஸ்க்காக செபிக்கிறோம் லீகலா அண்டவரை போராடி கொண்டிருக்கிறவர்களுக்காக செபிக்கிறோம் எல்லாரையும் நீங்க பார்த்து அவர்களை பிளஸ் பண்ணும்படியாக இணைந்து மீண்டுமாய் உமக்குள்ளாய் கட்டி எழுப்பும்படியாய் நாங்கள் செபிக்கிறோம் தகப்பனை ஹூரர ரப ரப தூஷரபோ அப்பா இந்த வேலையிலும் கர்த்தாவே இங்க இருக்கக்கூடிய எல்லா பார் அண்டவரை எல்லா நியூட் சென்டர்ஸ் அப்பா கிளப் பப் அண்டவரை பாவத்தை தூண்டுகிற அண்டவரை ஒவ்வொரு காரியங்களையும் நாங்க இந்த நேரத்தில் ஒப்புக் கொடுக்கிறோம் டார்க் வெப் ஒவ்வொருவருக்காகவும் <laughs> ஒவ்வொருக்காகவும் <laughs> Uh, may our god bless you more and more in jesus name praise the lord i want to pray and bless to all the people people are watching online right now from uk europe and africa north and south america and yes and bless to all the people in the name of the father and of the son and of the holy spirit i want to pray amen may our god bless you more and more in jesus name i pray amen and also may our god bless sister jordan uh, sister madan and end this family all the usa and all the nations in jesus name i pray amen so see you thank you very much tomorrow on which i'm preaching gospel in new york share praise the lord and traveling in the morning and traveling little bit around 300 miles are there from my home i am to drive so god bless you please keep me in your prayer thank you very much god bless you